And as part of its sensitization campaign to agro impute dealers and the farmers on safe use of agrochemicals and pesticides across Nigeria, the National Agency for Food, Drug Administration and Control, NABDAC, says food safety is key to every human life. The sensitization campaign aims to avert the dangers associated with the use of pesticides and agrochemicals in Nigeria. The DG of NABDAC, Professor Mujisola Adeyeye, made this known during a courtesy visit to an agro facility in Lagos. When you talk about the quality of a product, it runs through, it's a process, and part of that process is um, the storage of the materials, whether the raw materials or the finished materials, you know, that make the final product. So that's what we've come here to see, and from what we've seen, um, I, the, the, the comply with um, standards that um, make the products um, fit for use. So this is, the, this is the confidence we have because whoever complies with existing regulations and guidelines obviously will um, end up making products that are fit for use. It is a key part of our regulatory work to be sure that we come on onto these uh, major importers and uh, local producers to be sure of what they are doing, the, the stacking method, the distribution method, then the storage condition of these products that they use. Knowing fully well that food safety actually starts from the farm and then whatever you give to animal comes to man. So we, we engage them to be sure that they are doing the right thing. We need direct access to the Ministry of Agriculture. If we have issues, we should be able, without lobbying, you know, without anything, we should be able to go straight to the Ministry of Agriculture. Sir, ma, this is what is happening. How can you help us? That is what they do over there. You can walk into the Ministry of Agriculture of the Czech Republic. They will just say, okay, what do you want? How can we help you? You know, so those things, those ones are, those things are not available here. So then, as I said, it will be very, very helpful if government, maybe any institution directly working uh, with the government, to be in total control of the ports.